Hey folks, this is Dr. Timothy Lineski at Lake Cumberland Rheumatology. I'm coming to you from our offices in Somerset, Kentucky. Uh, today I want to talk to you guys about how to inject Humira. Humira is a TNF inhibitor, uh, which is FDA approved for a few different diseases, uh, most commonly rheumatoid arthritis, psoriatic arthritis, and uh, ankylosing spondylitis. So, uh, at least in the rheumatology world. So what we want to do here is whenever you get this, this is a little demonstration one, you will see that there will be some numbers, a number one, a number two, and then number three is what we'll talk about. So what you do is remove the cap, number one, maybe not drop it, and um, you'll see that there's this plastic piece here which springs in. Now if you look closely, which this is a demonstration one, your needle will be in there. So what you have to make sure you do whenever you do this is, is you want it to go and engage. See how this engages? So you don't just put it right on the surface of your skin and press the top button. You want to push it in so that you feel the, the white plastic go inward, okay? That's the key to make sure it works. So that's number one, take off that piece. Number two, take off the top. Now this is where you're going to press the button to do the injection. So, one, two, and then what I really want you to look at is, is inside here, there will be a color. Uh, different ones of these will use different colors and it'll tell you when you're done. In general, all you have to do is count to 10. So, you will hold. I'm gonna try to hold it so you can see. Obviously, you wanna do this in fat, in your belly, on your thighs. I'm just gonna demonstrate here because I don't wanna show you my belly. Um, so you're going to push it in, up against, and press the button. And did you see how that turned yellow there? And when it's done, it'll stop changing. You let go, and that's it. Dispose of this in a, uh, uh, hopefully you've been provided one of those red containers for uh, sharps and needles. And that's it, folks. Uh, Humera is one that you do every two weeks. Um, when it comes to some tricks to the trade, take it out of your refrigerator for a few minutes, at least 15 minutes. Kind of helps the mechanism warm up a little bit on the inside so you don't get any, you know, you're not sitting there trying to push this and it's frozen or, or too cold for it to change. Uh, also, if you put a little ice on your skin for, a, for 30 seconds, it'll kind of take a little of the sting out. Uh, Humera does tend to burn a little bit. Uh, it's not uncommon to get little red rashes or things like that uh, surrounding the area. Uh, but if you get any other uh, significant symptoms, you want to talk to your rheumatologist. Hopefully that was helpful to you. Uh, if you have any comments or questions, check us out on uh, Dr. Lineski, L-O-N-E-S-K-Y, on Facebook or Google+. And uh, ask me about any videos you want to see. Have a good day.